Hundreds of protesters have gathered outside the office of the Ukrainian president, Petro Poroshenko, in Kiev, demanding action be taken to free an unconfirmed number of soldiers trapped by separatist fighters at a border crossing in the Luhansk region. The demonstrators, made up mainly of family members of the soldiers, have been clear what should be done to solve the situation. This woman says she wants her husband and his platoon to receive reinforcements. They're completely surrounded and the Russian separatists have several rocket launchers. There's nowhere to hide. The trapped Ukrainian soldiers have been keeping in close contact with their families by telephone. Euronews' correspondent in Kiev managed to speak with one of the men and he said that the Russians have been killing his colleagues and have been told to be ready for an artillery bombardment. There's no food or fuel. The Ukrainian government has said they're trying to find a solution to the crisis. Ukraine's president has said the problem will be solved. There are many issues being discussed, rotating the soldiers, sending military aid. I simply can't comment on the specifics right now. Several protesters have held talks with the Kiev government over the plight of their family members. There have been unconfirmed reports that a total of three military brigades are trapped.